Just wanted to show how to open up uh, the Asus uh, RT-AC68U wireless router. Uh, I couldn't find any videos or how-tos about how to do it online and I figured it out so here's how it goes. Um, so when you look at it there's no obvious screws anywhere and if you're familiar with this kind of stuff usually it's just uh, plastic clips snapped together so you start that all around the edges you'll see that there's clips um, here in the corners here in the middle in the corner center all the way around there's a bunch of clips so usually you can get uh, a fingernail or uh, sometimes if you use these little uh, plastic picks or sometimes I just use a cut up piece of credit card you can peel it back a little bit and wedge it in there and you can just start working it down usually I found these center ones there and here are harder so if you start at the corner it's a little bit easier you can just uh, kind of wiggle it in there and start pulling what you want to do is, uh, once you find a clip, kind of press, press down, because the way the clip engages with the, the back case, I don't know if you can see it. Um, if you kind of press it down this way, it, it might help pop it off. So anyway, you just kind of have to work it all the way around. And once you do, you'll have it free all the way around. The problem is though, that it's still stuck. Like it won't come off, it won't release from the back case. And it took me a while to figure this out. And the secret is on the back, there are screws, but they're actually hidden behind this label, which is a sticker. So it's pretty easy. You just get a like a little screwdriver straight edge. I already had this started, but it's stuck back down. There you go. And kind of work an edge up and coming off easy for me because I already did it but you can just pull it all the way down it's pretty tough it didn't tear or rip for me it's like a hard kind of vinyl material so just set that aside save it it's the adhesive is pretty good and you'll see here on the back there are two holes for screws um, so there's one up here whoops One up here, and this is the screw. I'm dropping stuff. Looks like this, just a little black screw. So take that out of there. And another one here. This one had a little warranty sticker on it. So obviously, if you do this, your warranty is no good. Um, but probably if you're opening it, uh, they wouldn't fix it under warranty anyway. So take those two screws off, then finally the front will be released and the front cover and you can just pull it off if all the clips are released and there you go. So that's the board inside. Uh, and there are four screws that secure this down like this and it goes here 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 and here so just take those off there's also a uh, metal shielding here for the antennas that slides in at the top um, and fastens here with these little three screws up here. So you take that out, makes it easier to remove. 
and then this will just it's kind of easier if you do it this way because of the way the antenna uh, sockets uh, fit through the top of the case you'll kind of have to um, fold it up this way like this so if you hold it upside down you kind of push it back from these ports on the back you can just push that forward and then lift it out and pull it pull it kind of this way down so that these uh the antenna sockets will come out of the top of the case and that's it so that's the inside i don't know what you need to do with this but uh, i just needed to open it and check it out um, there are some screws in here, but I don't think they, it just holds the foot on. There's four screws down here on the base. And also there's a sticker under here, under the, uh, the sort of LED glowing logo on the back, but it doesn't do anything except hold that plastic piece in. It doesn't help you get inside. And there's also a rubber, uh, foot that's uh, stuck with adhesive here on the bottom of the of the of the case but again that that doesn't really get you access inside i guess if you just want to remove this foot piece you would have to take that apart but so that's it and putting it back together is just the same in reverse um, just the card screws the shielding at the top and then clip the front cover on screws on the back and put the sticker label back on and should be good to go.